Okay. Well, we'll do it like this. Smashburger has a uh, beer-battered Pacific cod sandwich. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. A little bit of uh, technical difficulties there. But yes, Smashburger does have a beer-battered Pacific Cod sandwich. We're going to check it out. $7.99, and they are using Yingling in their batter. So here we go. All right, check this out. I am not going to mince words. This looks amazing. This is the Beer Better Pacific Cod Sandwich. You're going to have a uh, cod filet lightly dipped in a yingling lager infused batter. Some American cheese, lettuce, and uh, tomato. And you're going to have a creamy tartar sauce. Yes, please. All right, wish me luck. Here we go. This is the beer battered Pacific Cod Sandwich, uh, $7.99. I was a little skeptical at the price, but this is a really big sandwich. Check it out right here. It is hefty, upside down. The more you turn me, inside out and round and round. Shout out, Diana Ross. Let's go. Here we go. Haven't had fish in a while. We're going to knock it out. Mm. Yeah, check that flaky piece of Pacific cod right there. Check that out. Mm. Now, creamy tartar sauce too gives it that nice little kick, that nice little extra uh, flavor. And you're going to need that on most of these whitefish uh, sandwiches, especially when you're eating any type of whitefish. Now, I personally have probably enjoyed hundreds of pounds of cod over uh, my lifetime, but check that out right there. I am liking the flavor of that. Nice little crunchy outside of that batter. And uh, the tomatoes were not mealy. Just did a review. Had some mealy uh, tomatoes on a sandwich I just did. But this is really good. Let's go in for a second bite. Catch of the day. Endorsement style. Here we go. Mmm. Yep. All right, so let me say this. I'm usually a fish purist. I usually don't put uh, any type of cheese on my fish or my fish sandwiches. To me, it just doesn't go together. I ordered this as is, and a lot of times on these sandwiches anyway, the cheese gets lost in the mix. And in this one, getting lost in the mix a little bit, I got a little bit of the cheese flavor at the end of that second bite. But one more time, flaky goodness. The flavor of that batter, I'm not necessarily getting any beer flavor, but it is a really nice flavored batter and it works perfectly with this cod and if you're not familiar with cod it is a white fish it is usually very flaky and light and this is a very light sandwich even though there's a lot going on here the bun is soft the lettuce is fresh like i said the tomatoes were fresh i'm gonna go in for one more bite i'm liking this there's no fish smell i have a couple friends that are like oh i don't do fish uh because of the smell no if people do it right and they're doing it right here you're not going to get a fish smell from eating a fish sandwich Come on, 2020. Shout out. Um, all right, let me go in for a final bite. We're going to give it a rating, but the beer battered Pacific Cod Sandwich uh, is hitting on every single mark right now. Again, I was skeptical at first, $7.99, uh, but it is a hefty, hefty, hefty uh, sandwich. Going in for the third bite. All right, so uh, not the best to clean the palate on a fish sandwich, but what are you going to do? One of the best tasting Kokomoko lattes I've had in a while. Shout out Duncan and a Smashburger review. Savage. All right, let's give that a rating, shall we? On a scale of 1 to 100, with 1 meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the Beer Battered Pacific Cod Sandwich from a Smashburger a rating of... Yeah. That is a really well-made uh, sandwich. It's fast casual, so do not try to compare that with any fish sandwiches at the fast food spots. That is an easy 91. Now, how does this stack up to the Culver's Walleye? I believe that's the one I had some years back. That was fire. That was so good. Now, look at this. A Culver's mention in a Smashburger review. Again, Savage.
for what do you want? I'm wearing a savage shirt. We're going to get some savage uh, comments. So uh, yeah, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing, smash burger. Light up the comments. Burger. Burger's in the name. Are you going to get a fish from a burger place? You know one of my favorite lines in a movie of all time? Clark W. Griswold. I'm so hungry I can eat a sandwich from a gas station. Vacation. All right, bonus footage. What do you think that if I ordered a burger from Smash Burger and had that on the bottom and then had this sandwich on top of it, a little surf and turf? Leave some comments below if you want me to possibly visit that because in my head it makes sense. It may not make sense. It may not make sense.